This is Frosty 8415. It's uh, Black Friday. And we're out taking a ride. My buddy come over and we went and picked up his motorcycle. And they, he had to take it back to the Harley shop. There was some issues with some, I don't know, something with the paint or something. And he wanted them to look at it. So we went by there and now we're out for a ride. It's like 75 degrees and beautiful, beautiful day here in Florida. It's been getting in yeah, the 40s and 50s at night, 52, 53, which is really nice. It's still good riding weather, actually. And uh, and then we get out once it starts. We ride some at night, and then we get up, ride some in the morning. But I thought I'd do a video so you guys can that are snowbound or kind of you know get a chance to look at some of the nice weather we're having down here. I know it's tough when you're sitting inside and there's nothing to do, guys. At least, you know, you can see somebody riding and enjoying the weather. Well, they shined it up, didn't they? It looks better. It does. I have to... Oh, yeah, they... Yeah, they took off and they scratched it up, too. That ain't how I do it, so... Yeah. Well, I'm thinking about taking uh, and buying that uh, turtle wax. That's, that's the, that hydrophobic. That, that Chemical Brothers has the same setup. Yeah. yeah. It's that yeah. ceramic coat, micro. Ceramic nano. coat, yeah. 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 That shit's badass. I'll try it and see how it does. Everybody That's pretty cool. Three weeks in the trees and all. That's pretty good. That's what I say. I don't think you guys want to see me get gas, so I'll uh, I'll start it back up in a little bit, guys. All right, guys, this is uh, 27 coming into the city of Ocala. We go out this way so that we can uh, avoid the traffic from downtown today, and uh, we're going to go down here and take a bypass road that goes right by 75. It's the uh, day after Thanksgiving, so Black Friday, so you know, it's traffic's not bad right now because a lot of people are at work, but this evening it's going to be outrageous because everybody gets out. Really, <coughs> everybody gets out and goes everywhere and looks for stuff, but you can actually order online nowadays. Absolutely gorgeous today guys. This is a beautiful little town. It's it's my wife and I are looking at finding there's a piece of property outside town and uh, you know out, out in out in the country and uh, Five acres or so, where I can build what I want, build a garage, and uh, have pretty much what I want. I don't like a subdivision living. I've, I've said that on other videos, and I'm just, I'm not a subdivision person. I 
I'd rather live out in the country where I can, you know, work on my motorcycle, work on my truck, my car, do everything myself. I, I've always been a hands-on kind of person. I, I like doing stuff, which is obvious, by the way, I've been uh, working on guns and stuff in my videos. That's cotton, guys. They grow cotton down here. It kind of looks like snow to some people, but uh, they grow cotton. Some people do. They don't grow a lot of it. Most of it down here, believe it or not, is uh, vegetables. They grow a lot of vegetables. You go down 75, they get on down in the state. Uh, they have every kind of vegetable you can imagine growing down there. Big farms. Plus, if you go over toward the uh, Daytona and Palatka, over that way, so have you down here for a bike week, you'll see that there's a lot of farms over there, big fields of cabbage and broccoli and different, you know, different foods. But uh, this is just a side road. They built this as a bypass to uh, for people to go around town to get some of these different roads without dealing with you know, going downtown, right over there, 75. We'll go under it here in just a second. But the sole purpose of this road was just to make traffic a little easier and bypass, you know, getting in downtown. Because, you know, the town has limited space for making the roads wider or anything like that because you'd have to start tearing down buildings and moving sidewalks and just not going to work so a lot of your businesses are moving into the outer lying areas you know strip malls and stuff like that but they have more flexibility for size downtown is nice they have a lot of older shops they have a lot of uh, they call them boutique shops this was a Mark III. Some of you may not remember, but they made uh, the Mark III vans. That was a Mark III factory there where they put out those vans. It closed down several years ago. And there's been several companies trying to get involved. I think somebody's involved in that part of it there now with manufacturing. They do sawdust here. And Things don't stay empty down here very long. Right over there, 75. You can see we parallel 75 all the way up through here. It just you just bypass it. You don't have to worry about the traffic. You don't have to worry about any of that. And a lot of these truckers just going, you know, not that far. They just go on these back roads and they bypass all that. But this is typical Florida roads here. With all these trees growing up over top of it, like a tunnel. That's why I just, I just love it. A lot of the roads are straight. Yep, they're just straight as they can be. But a lot of them are really nice and windy and cool. You know, in the summer when it's really, really hot down here, you will appreciate those trees. Oh man, I smell somebody's fireplace. You can smell that wood smoke. It smells so good. It makes me want to actually <laughs> makes me want to go home and barbecue. I think I'll call my wife and see if she wants to go pick up some stuff and I'll fire up the grill this evening and we'll have uh, barbecue for dinner. And this we're coming up on uh, 326 out here and this is uh, the road that connects over to 40, State Route 40. 40 goes from the ocean to the ocean, from the west coast to the east coast, from the east coast to the west coast. And it's, uh, it's a nice little road. It's the Ocala Forest, man, it's nothing. It's just, just highway. That's a good looking Camaro. Yeah, there's a bad 
Well, this is just all traffic, guys, so I'm going to cut it off and we'll start again in a minute.